Hey everybody, this is Kleiner Gamer here, and I'm here for part 4 of my Let's Play Super Mario Bros. 3. Last time I was here, I managed to finish off World 3 with some chaotic results, and me save staying a lot and rewinding an awful lot. And probably more of the same is going to happen here, so let's find out how it goes. So, first stage of World 4. Let's see how badly this goes. And oh, we're facing giant enemies. Oh dear, this could be very bad. Giant enemies, giant clouds. That being said, the pipes uh, don't look that much giant, gigantic. Well, let's get that mushroom. Thank goodness I got power up. Oh, got it. For some reason, I thought there was a hole there, like with the uh, with the flying Koopas there. For some reason, don't know what if I was thinking of there. Oh, let's avoid this. Uh... No, why did I do that? I think I put myself in that. Okay, good. I was gonna say I put myself in a very bad position there. Okay, two stars. Is it possible we're gonna get a third? Here's hoping, but I, I probably will not be surprised if I get a mushroom on that third slot. But let's find out. Oh my god, okay, right, avoid that giant piranha plant. Alright. Oh, goddamn cheap sheeps. Living up to your name again, are you? Oh my god. Okay, there. No! Oh, god, the cheap sheep, but then the fireball got me. Alright. I avoid these giant plants again. Oh, god damn it. Flying cheap cheeps. Gotta love them, eh? Yep, I knew it. <laughs> I knew it was gonna get a mushroom there at the end. I knew I was gonna get that at the end. I'm not surprised. It's always a common thing to me. Right, okay, here's my opportunity to get a power up here. Just hope I don't end up picking the wrong one. Okay, good. Got a flying power up there, that'll serve me quite well there. Alright, stage three of uh, World 4, what are we dealing with? Oh god, giant hammer bros, of course we are. Oh no, and giant hammers. Even better. So let me just avoid them. Oh, god damn it. Oh, and he s stepped on me. Okay. Oh, wow, well, okay, right, so yeah, I've got to be careful. Oh, no, that's even worse. Okay, yeah, so if he stomps the, the ground there, you won't be able to move, so you have to be careful with your timing. Okay, now we're underground. Honestly, good, I'd rather be underground than face those uh, giant... Those giant hammer bros. Much safer here. Sure it's a little bit risky with the these enemies dropping down from the roof like that. Oh no. Okay, go back. No! God damn it! Why am I forgetting to press the A button? Alright. Jump. There. That's better. For goodness sake. I need to remember that more often. Why? Ah! Oh! So focused on the mushroom that I ended up falling off. Of course I did. There, that's better. If I act fast enough and get that mushroom, then I'll be okay. Probably should have relied on... Oh, okay, that was close. Okay, let's... 
I'd say I'd go a long way for that one up. We'll need that. I was going to say, how funny would that have been if I got that one up and immediately lost it? <laughs> and then I would have been like, well, that life was all for nothing because of my, because of my lack of skill. To put it politely. Alright, so, oh, we got a card uh, opportunity, right, good. Now, I should be able to get this done without any problems now. Nope, okay, fair enough. Right, good, now I'll be able to get it done. Nice, we did it. Good stuff, right, okay, so now let's move on to, I think it's the castle next, yes it is. Wants to move to the side. Now I think it's this one we go down. Yeah, I think it's this one because uh, there's a power up here as well as a few coins. Uh, what? Why am I not um, able to go up? Okay. Hold on a minute, what on earth is happening here? Am I in the right place? Alright, wait for that ghost to catch up on me. That's weird. Why on earth is the... Unless, have I to jump back up there then? I think I'm... no. Alright, fine. Let's just run for it. Oh, right, that's it. Okay, there's a hidden block there. Oh, the two of them blocks, right. That explains it. I was about to say, how on earth am I not able to get up there? But then, of course, there's hidden blocks. Right, there we go. Now we're time for the boss battle, and yet yeah, again, just a small Mario. Oh, God, yeah, that knew it was only a matter of time before they got me. Alright, there we go. I'm telling you, if I was playing this on... If I was doing a Let's Play this on the original Nintendo Entertainment System without any benefits like uh, rewinding or save states, then I would have done terrible at this. Let me just see where this pipe takes me. Oh, it just takes me to the other one that's at the bottom, right? Fair enough. And where am I wanting to go after that? Oh, it's another uh, bonus opportunity. They line up the pictures. Oh, too soon. That's a shame there. I could have gone three lives with that if I wasn't too quick with that. I probably should have got a power up first. Because I'm a bit worried about this. Giant enemies under war, I don't like this. Oh, maybe not the giant enemies, but those will definitely hurt me. Oh, is that it? I expected a lot more threats than that, personally. Alright, okay, so they've got two stars again. And most of the better than the next one, I'm gonna get a mushroom on that third one. Yeah, again. Oh, what's this? I'm facing three hammer bros. Do you know, might as well use that invincibility for all of them. get a clear power up for that one. Well, the stars are there, so I might as well use them. <laughs> and they know that I, I've got a star, and that's why they're retreating. Oh, now he's moving forward. He's being very daring, though. I wonder why. I, I don't know why he is, but fair enough because I've already got another invincibility power-up. 
and I got another one. Sweet. <laughs> Okay, so now it's time to head to the fifth level. Look out for these giant... Oh god, he squished me. Oh, there's another one. Okay, fair enough. Got him. Hopefully that's a mushroom. Yes. Bullet bills as well, great. Even better. Just what I need. Oh god. Oh, okay, right, I'm guessing the... Oh no! I'm guessing those red ones are homing. Yeah, they are. They're homing. Oh god. Oh. Okay, let me... I just want to see something. Can I still... No, I don't want to do that. I want to see if I can damage... Yeah, I can still... Oh. And of course I'll jump in one that's right above me. Right, wait for that one. There. So it doesn't exactly home in on me, it just follows in the same direction as I'm going. Oh, and they seem to be randomised as well. Well, that was a close one. Oh, nice! Finally broken the cycle. Got five, uh, five one-ups there for that. About time. That's about time that I managed to do that without, um, without awkwardly getting a mushroom there in between. Oh, can I do this? Oh my god, yes! That's twice I've now broken the cycle. That's another five one-ups. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't think it was that easy to game one-ups in this, but there you go. Or right, let's get into the castle, the next castle for this one. See how bad this one's going to be. Didn't actually mean to stomp on the dry bones first, but that's fair enough. Actually, I want to jump on these dry bones so I can get that. There we go. Because I believe this reveals a... Yes, it does. A hidden door. Oh, I think if I jump on this, it'll uh, change the direction of that. Yes. Not exactly that way, though. Jumping on it incorrectly. Right, there we go. Oh, okay, I think the uh, piranha plant ended up eating it, so I'm going to have to do that again. Alright, do you know what that, I think that'll do. Alright, so I think I need to go up one of these pipes. Which one is it I need to go up, though? I think it may be, yeah, it's this one, isn't it? Yeah, it's that one. And then I jump on this one again. Yeah, I screwed that one up, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Hold on a minute. Nope, didn't want to do that either. Oh, I suppose that works. Oh, wait, no, that, that works as well. Oh, okay, wait. That didn't go according to plan. Oh, right, I'll have to do that again then. So I'm supposed to write that all the way up, right? Note to self, make sure to do that. Now jump again. And jump again. There we go, much better. Right, now let's go down the pipe. So the next boss should be... Oh, what have we got here? Oh, we got some one-ups. Sweet. How many? Three of them. Nice. Oh, now here, here's the boss. I didn't mean to do 
that. Okay, right, fair enough. At least I got him. I was almost about to run out of time on that one because I took uh, too long with the trying out the P switch there. Mm, I could go to the castle, but I want to do another level here. So let's do that first. I have to say, these worlds have been very... Even though I've beaten this game before, it's uh, very wacky and quite mysterious. Like, the giant enemies... Like, the giant Goombas seem to be very, very... <laughs> quite scary, actually. I was about to say, I better not be trapped there. Because if I got trapped there, that would have been very unfortunate. Oh god, really? I end up stomping that one, but his, his brother is like, Nope, you're not getting you're not getting him that easily, you're gonna have to deal with me. And he stomps me to death. Damn. <laughs> oh, why, okay, that was, I should have paid more attention to that one. That's fair enough. That's what I get for not paying attention. There was an enemy right there as well. Alright, let's uh, see what we got here. Another car flipping game. I don't know why any of these are, so let's see if I can get lucky. I know that one's there. Oh, another star one. Nope, didn't think so. I got lucky of one pair. Alright, let's head up to Toad's house again. And uh, pick another box. Oh, another flying ability one, that'll be very handy. We're heading to the final castle already, Wall 4, that's quite, uh, quite quick. Only it seems like the king's been transformed into a small dinosaur from what it looks like. Either that, so that looks like a Charmander from Pokemon, or it's a small dinosaur, like a small T-Rex. Or it's baby Stegosaurus. Well, okay, that was close. I have been very lucky again in my lives back from the disastrous first two parts I had. Oh, no, okay, right, no, that's not happening. No, really touched the very tip of it, damn. Oh, I did that again, go on, damn it, right, come on. Thank goodness I'm small there. <laughs> Usually I'm not very happy about being small, but in this case I'm very glad I am because I was able to, to get under that very efficiently. Much more of these fire contraptions that I have to endure. Oh, num. Right, there we go, that's better. Okay, wait just now, because that's going pretty slow, the side scrolling. And now we go. What? Oh, did I go too fast? I think I went way too fast or I jumped into more of a... Yeah, I jumped into more fire. I thought the game punished me for going too fast there for a second. I was like, wait a minute, no, 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 you're going too fast. You can't go that fast. Therefore, we're going to kill you by default. <laughs> it's like, who do you think you are, Sonic? He's not around yet. 
Alright, nice. Okay, we beat that boss without any difficulty and managed to get back the magic wand. Alright, very good. Another letter from the princess. But let's see what she has to say. What other power up is she going to give me? The thief who stole the whistle has escaped to the east side of the sand dunes. I have enclosed a jewel that helps protect you, Princess Tolstoy. Alright, very good. So, world five. Now, we're not going to do this one just yet. As a matter of fact, I'm going to leave that there. I'm going to save there. So, that's uh, pretty much it for part four. So, I will see you all again next time for parts five and six when I record them for next time. So, until then, see you again soon and hope you take care. Bye-bye.